in a problem like this, we know we can only. You're right, it is r. We know that x equals r cosine of theta. Correct? There is no such thing as secant that we know of as far as converting. So let's go and replace secant with cosine. Well, secant is 1 over cosine of theta. Yes, so in reality, actually, you could even say it looks like this. r equals 3 divided by cosine of theta is really the same thing as this. You don't need to write this. I'm just showing you how those are all equivalents. So again, if I want to write this in terms of x's, what would happen if I multiplied by cosine on both sides? I would definitely get rid of the cosine of theta on the right side. Now I have r cosine of theta equals 3. And what does r cosine of theta equal? There you go. It's amazing. It's called math magic. <laughs>